Arena is going to be filled with some of the biggest and best ballers in the NBA. The Pistons getting ready to take on the Charlotte Hornets for the official home opener tonight and the new opener of the new arena. Casey Hollins live outside the arena with a whole bunch of fans out there and the fanfare going with them all. Hi, Casey. Hi, Stephen. Yeah, their fans are starting to, the crowd is starting to build out here in the Chevrolet Plaza. And if you thought that it was just native Detroiters that were excited about the Pistons move downtown, you would be wrong. I actually met a family from Anaheim, California that traveled all the way up here just for the occasion. Die-hard Piston fan since I was five years old. Uh, got to go to the Palace before Ben Wallace left, uh, and ever since we found out about the new arena, we said we can't miss it. So we don't miss any games for the past, me for the past 35 years, and now my young son's kind of doing the same thing. So keeping the tradition going. Then how excited were you guys when you found out that they were moving to this brand new arena? Oh, we're super excited. We're just so excited to be a part of this special day and with our kids and just create another memory regarding the Pistons. And for fans like Charmaine Huntley, tonight has been a long time coming. I am a native Detroiter. I love Detroit. I lived in Charlotte for seven years and I love the Pistons and I'm just so excited about them coming home and it's, just, it's historic and I'm just happy to be a part of it. What do you think of the impact the arena so far has had on the city? I think it's great. I mean, it's one of the only downtowns in the country where all your major sport teams are just a couple of blocks away. I think it's really important to the city for the rebirth of Detroit to have everyone down here, you know? Fans are excited for the new season and they know expectations are pretty high. That was a little bit of a, uh, a sad end to last year and I think that they're going to rebound and they've got some uh, critics to prove wrong. Do you think they can turn things around? I believe so. I believe if they just continue to stay focused and um, get some superstars, they'll be all right. Players now starting to make their way into the arena and later at 6 o'clock I'm actually going to talk with at least one of them and find out why they're excited to finally kick off the regular season here in downtown Detroit. For now, we're reporting live in downtown Detroit. I'm Casey Hollins, 7 Action Sports. Back to you. All right, Casey, thank you so much.